During the global pandemic, Dr. Willard Wigan, MBE, holder of two Guinness World Records for the smallest sculptures ever made by hand, decided to honor those in the fight against COVID-19 by doing what he does best. We underestimate little things. Human beings do, they disregard something because they can't see it. Just because you cannot see something doesn't mean it doesn't exist. So I'm thinking, right, I'm gonna make something that's never been done before, a microscopic memorial. Set on the end of a tiny hypodermic needle, this sculpture is dedicated to the numerous scientists, doctors and nurses doing their very best to deal with the victims of COVID-19 and to defeat the virus. It'll be exhibited to the general public auctioned to the highest bidder, and the proceeds will be donated to charity. What I've made is something small with the biggest message in the world. Never underestimate something you can't see. Look at the universe, but look how small we are in comparison to the universe. We're microscopic, because we are in a little fight. It's a war. Everyone's on the front line to fight this COVID-19. The NHS staff out there are doing such a, such a great job. Willard is a very talented man indeed. His sculptures are truly amazing. It's um, a fantastic thing what he's doing for a fantastic cause. So uh, I'd like to wish Willard every success in raising as much money as you can. Let's all dig deep. Let's support this great cause. So let's get behind this and uh, try and bid up as much as we can for charity. All the best in raising awareness and also money. Keep up the good work. Please God, it's always soon and we beat this coronavirus. But let's help raise a lot of money. So let's get behind him. Let's all um, support them and send our love out to NHS. Well done, Willard. You are truly world class. Hopefully we'll beat this. Let's support this and let's beat this virus. We're gonna all work together and make it, make this work and beat this virus. Put it back to where it belongs. Good luck, stay safe. I'd love, love to thank Richie Woodall, uh, Joe Egan, John H. Stracy, Kelly Maloney, all those ex-fighters and fighters today who, who have actually supported me on this, this campaign to create this microscopic memorial. To do this type of work, it takes a lot of effort, a lot of energy from my body, to keep my hands still, to hold my breath, to work between my heartbeat, to make sure that it stands on the end of this small hypodermic needle. So the nurse is on the end fighting the COVID. The scientists and NHS workers, they deserve the biggest praise in the world. Because of this pandemic, it's made us realise what we, what we miss. There's a saying, you never know what you've got until it's gone. Love is very powerful. If there's more of that in the world, it'd be a lot better world.